this is a quick little jam, uh, kind of a reggae feel. So it's in B minor, and um, what I'm doing here is just barring the uh, seventh fret and uh, hitting this. I guess it would be a B minor seventh. I'm not doing a full um, minor shape there, which would be that. I'm just barring the uh, the ninth fret on the A string. Okay, and then I'm going to the uh, fourth. So this is E minor seventh. So this is a minor, an A minor shape with with um, nothing on the uh, G string. And sliding that up two frets to the fifth position or the fifth. So then underneath that, I recorded a loop of that, and then underneath that I just did this, putting it on the neck pickup, give it a little, a little more bass. So I'm just going back and forth between the 5th and the 7th fret. Kind of fun to do. That's all I have as um, I have those two layers in a loop, and then soloing options are just really open because you can do all of the B minor pentatonic stuff, so all that stuff, and uh, then you've got the minor uh, stuff you can throw in, so the B minor, um, so that arpeggio there. And then, of course, this minor scale, which is derived from uh, your, your relative major. So you've got B major, B minor, and the relative major, D major. So if I start on the D note, which would be this, it's that minor shape. You, hopefully you know that one. You may not. Um, I'll post a link to some tab for that. But that's really uh, what you can play around with, and there's a nice little arpeggio here. And there's another one here. Right, if you slide that same shape, this is really a minor chord shape, so slide it down two frets. So you can have fun with that. Here it is.